What is going on guys, Leon Gids here, and today we are back for the first sneak peek of Warzone Firefight. So let's get straight into this, shall we? So first of all on there, we've got the two new modes coming, we've got Warzone Firefight and Score Attack. After that, we've got three new maps, with one only being revealed called Prospect. Now, if you remember from one of my sneak peek videos, when I was predicting a new Forge Canvas or a recre recreation of Forge World, this is what it was, it was called Tidal, it is a forge canvas. Now if this looks like it's just going to be a long water plane like out of Halo 2 Anniversary, which if you remember that from Halo 2 Anniversary, let me know. But let's get straight into the wrecks. So first of all we've got a Temple Banshee, now this looks pretty cool because the Ultra Banshee is already OP and I don't know how you're going to make it even more OP, but they, they it might be OP, we'll have to see what happens. When it comes out, unless they've already put something on, no, they haven't. After that, we've got a new emblem called Valkyrie, which looks pretty cool. And then after that, there's two more emblems. You can see by the outline of it, so that's how I, I'm predicting it anyway. And then after that, we've got a new stance. It looks like it's going to be. And then we've got two new armor sets. We've got Cinder and Cyclops. Now these armors look pretty cool, you know. Like the Cyclops one looks a bit like different from the regular armor. <laughs> Which is cool. It's just, it's nice to see new armor coming in. Oh wait. Uh, and after that we've got I'm not quite sure what these are. I'm guessing armor, but I'm, I'm not quite sure. Actually no. Temple Wraith. The rare one's a temple wraith, I'm guessing. Guessing the temple wraith. The next two after that are armor. And then I don't know the next, I think Temple Ghost maybe, like the yellow one, and the one next to it, I'm not quite sure. But then we've got a new armor mod called Patrol Case now, this looks like an ammunition kind of arm, um, armor mod, so I'm guessing you might get like loads, like more ammo, or you might be able to pick up ammo from dead, well you already can, but I mean, you get more ammo from dead bodies and etc. Now if you remember one of my videos about new Brute Plasma Rifles, these were the two Brute Plasma Rifles. Now if you, if anyone's like, oh no, this one's going to happen, but it did happen. These two new Brute Plasma Rifles are coming and I already have the descriptions for them. I'll have to find them. But I remember that the Sorrow of Teach has a increased heat dissipation and increased accuracy and the scale of Sawyerat has uh, increased damage with a uh, a deadly melee bludgeon. So some sort of new melee coming along with this new brute has my which is pretty cool. Then after that we have got I think it looks like beam rifles. I'm thinking beam rifles. Uh, anyone else agree with me on this one? Beam rifles? Let me know in the comments what you think. I'm um, the only thing I'm not quite sure on is this middle blue one. Just underneath Cyclops. But other than that, this is all pretty cool. Now this update is supposed to be the biggest update coming to Halo 5. Now in terms of maps and game modes, yes, we've got four maps technically. We've got the Forge Canvas included and two new game modes, Firefight and Score Attack. But however, the wreck sheet is literally the regular size of... It's actually smaller. Like, the wreck sheet is actually smaller than the wreck drop from the last update. Like, you know, the small little wreck drop. Hog wild. Now, if they're gonna make it the biggest, that they they could at least add more wrecks because that'd be pretty cool to see at least. But uh, I don't know it's not up to me, I suppose. Anyway, guys, moving straight on after that, we have got a full scale picture of the one that has been zoomed in the whole time, and it is it is on Forge. Now, if we look on the picture, which will be on the screen, there's a pig wearing sunglasses in the bit background. We've also got a stacked up like triangle of cups. We've got a ready scout. We've got a ready scout hog, which is on forge. So I don't know about that. Maybe Rex are coming back. And we've got um, a sunflower. Uh, sunflower? Um, a umbrella. Sorry. With a chair underneath and a surfboard. Then I'm not quite sure what this green thing is in the middle. That's yeah, I'm, I'm not quite sure. And then we've got a screenshot of Tidal Wave. Oh, not Tidal. Oh, just Tidal, sorry. Anyway, guys, 
tell me what you think about this update. If you, if you think you're going to play it, if you think you're going to like it. Personally, I'm pretty excited because there's three new maps and I'm presuming they're all Warzone. And the new Banshee looks pretty cool. And I'm presuming there's an Ultra Ban uh, Temple Banshee and Ghost because the outlines of, of uh, the pictures are gold. And why wouldn't they bring two new other Covenant vehicles, Temple? It makes sense. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, make sure you leave a like, comment, subscribe. As soon as every you want to keep up with the latest Halo news, subscribe to this channel. Always be on up to date with it. Peace.